where was I? <laughs> well, I'm so happy to see my buddy. I haven't seen him in almost a year, and before that, it's been like four years. He's a good guy. But here, let's do a quick little video, uh, thing about this. Japanese man. See, it doesn't really roll off the tongue like Florida man, because Florida man wouldn't get arrested after dating 35 women at the same time in a bid to get, quote, hashtag, birthday presents, hashtag. Why would you get arrested for dating 35 women? See, this is why Florida man can never live in Japan. Is that illegal? Japanese man, hold on, let's see if you can get us like this. Okay, Japanese man has been arrested after reportedly dating more than 34 women at the same time. Takashi, my new fucking hero, Miyagawa, he's only a part-time worker, he's a full-time lover, is being investigated for allegedly defrauding dozens of women by pretending he was serious about each of their relationships and receiving hundreds of pounds worth of gifts from them. Hold on. This sounds eerily like Warren Ellis. And it depends on what you mean, hundreds of pounds of gifts. Because if, what if it's only like four girls, but they're really fucking fat, and the gift they're given is squeezing the life out of them while they ride them? Mr. Takishi, Miyawa, I can understand why you're only a part-time worker, because it must be a full-time job unwrapping all those gifts. And why are you arrested? Oh, hold on. Let's read that again. Hold on. Allegedly defrauding dozens of women but pretending he was serious about them. No. They're just stupid. Girls do it to fucking guys all the fucking time. Like, they'll be fucking having sugar daddies all over the fucking place. This guy goes to jail. At least in holding. I hope you have a good lawyer to get you out of your pimpish ways. I'm sure that these dumb bitches gave you shit out of the good kindness of their heart. It's not like you stole it from them. Defraud. So every time you break up with a girl, you you engaged in fraud to keep me around this long. No, bitch. Thanks for the Star Wars Lego kits. <laughs> he was apparently caught out. Caught out. When the women joined forces to create a victim's association <laughs> after discovering his extensive infidelity and reported him to the police. And obviously the local media. Hold on. So, ring, ring. Uh, hello, Japanese police. Are, oh, there's a man here cheating on me with somebody. You come arrest him. I'm not sure if I can do that. Here, asshole. Takashi. Taki. Taki. What's his name? Takashi Mikawa. He's only a part time worker. I fuck him full time. <laughs> And so the 35 other people. How many men? 35 of What the? <laughs> Come arrest this guy. Because Ho's mad. Like, okay. He's playing the field. Like, if, you, if, if, if any man, any normal man can uh, juggle two bitches. You know, I was like, okay, you're going to get caught. But once you work your way up to like five... And the nine and ten. He probably has a traveling job. Then fifteen. And not getting caught, right? Twenty. Twenty-six. Thirty-five! Thirty-five. Thirty fucking five women. All on the hook. Jesus, dude. So, somebody send this guy a cookie cake. Holy crap. But now you got a whole army after you. A bunch of ch chattering Asian women. Up, 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 up. It, like, it, if I could uh, just hit a button, and every time I go, beep, beep, up, 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 and then it's two of me doing that, and then three, and then 35. <sighs> just a cacophony of, what the? 35, dude. Anyway, among the claims is he gave each woman a different date for his birthday, yeah. And showing a constant stream of gifts. That's fucking awesome, dude. Takashi... Takashi... Miyagawa. Miyagawa! I gave you Star Wars Lego sets every year. And he's like, yeah, 
I got a warehouse full of them. Thanks. I think you're the one who gave me the prequel ones. Mm, I don't remember. <clears throat> one 47-year-old woman reportedly thought his birthday was on February 22nd, which I'm sure... Don't worry about it, Takashi Nagawa. I will keep your secret. That's his birthday. Another age 40 was told it was July, while another 35-year-old believed his birthday was in April. The only thing I have wrong with this paragraph is that she's 47. Another was 40 and a 35-year-old. But, okay, that makes sense. You don't want... He probably did it the right way, right? We probably learned from him. You don't want 35 uh, girlfriends that are all in their 20s. I mean, that's why guys shoot themselves like one is enough so you get the 47 year old one you know she's independently wealthy one way or another uh you know down to earth somebody you can get down with right just hang out have fun get gifts uh 40 again a woman who you know has been around and someone you can actually have a conversation with then 35 year old and i think it'll be the 35 year old that depending on what they bought them the 35-year-old might take it a little bit harder because she was probably having problems dating anyway, like she was a hoe, and then throughout her whole 30s, she cleaned up, and now she just avoids men because she's afraid of her own sexuality. Weirdo. The 35-year-old probably got this whole thing together, a victim's association. In total, he allegedly received around 100000 uh, about $10,000 worth of gifts from the women and a suit $200 oh that's like a $500 suit Congre uh, guaranteed it wasn't the young woman that bought it for him probably that 47 not the 35 she's still I think is really bitter Miyagwa from the Kansai region allegedly began his dating spree while working for a marketing company selling shower products sounds like he travels dude and it hasn't been said yet. We haven't got that far yet. I don't think he's supporting 35 women. He's like running the gambit of the dating scene. You know, boom, boom, boom. Whenever he says he's going to work, he's, he's not going to work. He, he's going to his other girlfriend's house. 35 women is a lot. And no wonder there's an association. Imagine two bitches being bitter. And you got to worry about 35 and then all their friends and all their mamas, it's over 120 people that are pissed off at you. It's a good thing you travel because they never know when you're coming to town. <clears throat> Police are reportedly investigating to find out whether any women were taken in by the alleged serial dating scheme. It's not a scheme, man. He's just dating. Bitches felt like buying him shit. What's the matter with you? The story elicited mixed responses online with one reader commenting that he's an awful person, but I... oh. <laughs> He's an asshole, but I envy, envy his time management skills. No shit. Congratulations. You got caught, but I mean, you don't just get 35 girls, girlfriends, and then, like, you're caught overnight. Like, imagine when he only had 12 or 15. He wasn't getting caught then. And how many of these girls actually gave a shit? Probably didn't. He... One, two, three. I just found out... Benny Hempy cheated on me. Oh, wait, that's a dude. I don't know. I can't tell. Japanese people are often very androgynous. But anyway, one, two, three. Another thing. Were all 35 of these victims, uh, you know, natural born females? The world may never know. But anyway, thanks for joining me. Uh, Hannibal will be back. We might do another video. And we'll talk to you later. Bye.